Good evening. We begin tonight with breaking news. San Diego can take the next step forward to reopening the state of California, giving San Diego the green light tonight, approving the county's plan to move forward through stage two, which includes dining in at restaurants and in-store retail with modifications. Supervisor Nathan Fletcher tweeted out the announcement just minutes ago, and he's going to be joining us uh, live here via the phone to talk more about exactly what this means. Supervisor, thank you for joining us tonight. Thank you, Kathleen. Thank you for having me. Well, tell me, what does this mean exactly? What can people expect and how soon will this go into effect? Well, this is another positive step forward as a region. And once businesses fill out their safe reopening plan, post it publicly, share it with their employees, they can go uh, effective immediately. How did you find out about this? We weren't expecting news on this front until Friday. Well, we've been monitoring the updates from the state of California. And as soon as they posted it, we were notified. And given we've been working with businesses to prepare for this moment, we wanted to share it immediately. And with people now able to dine in at restaurants and shop inside stores, does that mean that starts tomorrow? And, and what do people need to know before they try to go to these places? Well, it'll start as soon as businesses can, can be ready and fill out their plans and move forward. Some will move faster than others. Uh, but what we really want the public to know is, is we have to continue the forward progress. We have to act responsibly. We have to use face coverings. Uh, we have to continue physical distancing. Uh, we want to continue to be mindful that coronavirus remains a threat, and we want to continue on the path of reopening. Now, you were the only one to vote no when uh, the county was trying to move even quicker and accelerate into sure. stage three in certain sectors of that. Now that we've been given the green light in stage two, are you more on board with that pilot program that's been proposed? Well, we're only seven minutes into stage two. So I think it's appropriate, let's implement this, let's see how it goes, let's monitor the progress, and then let's prepare for stage three. And what about testing? Today you announced the single highest number of daily tests conducted, but still short of your daily goal of 5,200 a day. How important is that in green lighting moving forward into stage three for you? Well, we've made considerable progress and we wanna continue that uh, right now, we're in a good position. We're doing considerably more testing than most other counties, but it's not enough. And so that is a vital component. The ability to test, trace, and treat uh, is foundational to the entire effort to come out of this. And so hopefully we'll continue to see the progress, and, and, and I expect we'll get to our goal very soon. And San Diegans are chomping at the bit hearing this news tonight. Before they race out to go to their favorite restaurant or go to their favorite store, what do they need to know? What is the last word you want to have on this subject? Just we've made tremendous sacrifice and we've made tremendous progress. And, and in order to continue that progress and to honor that sacrifice, we all need to do our part. We need to be responsible. Uh, we need to look out for one another. We need to protect one another. Um, and and let's, let's support our local businesses because they've paid a tremendous price. Instead of go big and go home, uh, starting to hear people say go small and go home and shop at the small businesses. Shop local. That's exactly right. Shop, so support your local businesses. All right. Well, Supervisor Nathan Fletcher, we thank you for your time in explaining what we can expect as we move further into stage two.